Om Shanti, welcome back and now we are doing the recording of 24th of August, God Blessing. Supreme Godfather wants us to become somebody who is earning blessings from others. Now this is something which is mentioned in this beautiful blessing. What is the sign that we are actually earning blessings from other people? We are going to explore that in a bit. So stay on to this and let's go ahead with today's blessing. Supreme Godfather says in the title, May you be one who easily receives everyone's blessings through your balance of karma and yoga and become an embodiment of success. Let's get into the details now. Someone who has yoga in karma. Now yoga is not the physical yoga that you're putting your leg on top of your head when you're doing your karma. No, that's a separate thing. That's a separate chapter. God is talking about having a union with your true powerful pure loving kind generous happy self and also with the ocean of all these sources of love or happiness or bliss and power that means you are actually an infinite being having an infinite experience and you're not into the limited into the finite i did this much what did i get in return i spent so much upon you what is my return no we're not doing business in this world of relationships we cannot do business in this world with the five elements we cannot do business with work we have to give and give and give and because when we are giving that's the time when we are growing god then says someone who has yoga and karma and karma in yoga that means they are having yoga in karma they are connected to this feeling and they're doing the karma and they are having karma in yoga. That means they are conscious of these energies while doing karma. Is the one who has an elevated consciousness and an elevated stage. I'm talking about mental and emotional stage over here, God says. And creates an elevated atmosphere. So what's your kind of atmosphere there in the office, workplace, their house? with their relations or anywhere when they are connected to the Supreme Creator nothing deters them nothing hampers their peace of mind nothing makes them feel less and the sign of ego is when we feel hurt or insulted that means there is ego within us now people generally say that it's normal to have ego God says when you have ego you are not on the right path because you are going to destroy yourself and destroy your own peace of mind, destroy your happiness, destroy your love for that person or anything. So God says that you will spoil the atmosphere, first your own atmosphere in your mind and then the atmosphere of that workplace. Such a karma yogi claims a right to receive blessings from everyone, somebody who has elevated stage and creates an elevated atmosphere. Such a karma yogi claims a right to receive blessings from everyone. By having a balance in karma and yoga, you definitely receive blessings from the Father for every action and you also receive blessings from whoever you come into connection and relationship with. Everyone believes that such a person is good. Imagine, if somebody is complaining about you or not satisfied with you, there can be many reasons for that. Somebody has over expectations from you somebody doesn't like certain traits in you and they're not happy with you so if you're not changing for ourselves and we have the ego to not to change for the other person then we cannot adjust anywhere we can only adjust when we are like water and my friend when we are like water that's the time we can adjust in any situation with any person and to be like water is an art which we learn in Brahma Kumaris. It's an art of being infinite. Not being physical conscious, but being soul conscious or infinite energy conscious or the infinitism conscious. Or in science, we call it quantum consciousness. So God wants us to become that kind of consciousness which is unlimited. Then God says, such a person is good and it is their, and it is their blessings, this 
that are the blessings which people give them that they feel blessed because somebody when they call you you're a good person or they're ready to help you out just because you're a good person that is the blessing so where there is blessings there is cooperation and it is the these blessings and cooperation that make you into an embodiment of success now this is the pramastra so think about it do people in your workplace do people in your household do people in your job do people in your organization think of you as a good person or they find flaws in you because if they're finding flaws in you something has gone bad something is not right and this is where we need to check ourselves change ourselves change ourselves means change our energies with meditation how do you do that is what we learn in brahma kumaris you're most welcome for the same day course with the som shanti